Hey guys, I'm LB, and we are back playing Numa Breath of Life. Last episode, we did this incredibly tedious tile puzzle where you had to, like, look at it in just the right way to get the, all the tiles to be the same. That was a nightmare situation. But, uh, oh, this is a really nice picture. Let me take this picture. There we go. Picture taken. It opened this door instead of that door, which was what I expected. This door opened for some reason. And, uh... How does compartmentalization square with consciousness? This subconscious, what's that doing? Keeping secret knowledge. Even as a god, the idea of trudging through my subconscious is somewhat nightmarish. Some things, best not known, even for the all-knowing. Alright, so. That is the path we have to take through this room. Which means we start... We start right there. And go basically like this. That's my guess. What is with the lighting in this game? Get your act together, lighting engine. Well, that did something. Did it open this door? Indeed it did. Look at that. Look at these steps. These are some nice steps. What is this? The There's so many cool visuals in this game. God is the crushing loneliness. I don't really feel I have an equal. This wall, for instance. And don't get me wrong, he's a smart-looking wall. I enjoy being around him, but he has little of interest in conversation. Very flat personality. Like the bridge from earlier. Very anthropomorphized. <laughs> Oh, it's the ones that I walk on. Okay. I don't even know if the overall orientation matters or not. Can't move the center one, so okay. That that makes things a bit easier then, at least. So now we just line this up, right? Okay, then. Whee! Why is this in this game? Why is this- why is this a thing that exists? Why does anybody have to do this? I guess miscellaneous task quota had to be met. I'm so much- I'm so glad that they made the terrain test after this, because the terrain test is a much better game. Wow, that is very generous. What do we have here? Three. Is this... gonna help me in the third thing? Cause this was one, we did two last time. Oh <laughs> What is happening here? Oh, wow. That's also a cool picture. There's all kinds of cool pictures in this game. I love giant machines. The bigger the machine, the better. This is my idea of heaven. There's something about a giant machine that screams godlike. Me and my machines, animated, as if alive, but really just acting inside a closed system. They give the impression they are full of life, but they are just wheels and cogs that turn in time. Ticking, clicking, and clacking contraptions. Oh no. Oh no. Where is my objective, apparently? I need to find the objective first to even know what I'm working towards. Is it in one of the towers, or...? Okay, it looks like that tower is the tallest, so maybe that's my objective. That does appear to be the tallest tower. Because I can't rotate that part, right? Yeah, I can only rotate what's under it. Right. Why? This one doesn't even have any connections. So this is annoying, like, it would be easier if I could see the tower connections on these things, but no. Game decided no. What is up with- I can't, like, rearrange these, can I? What is the point of that? <laughs> oh man, you can get stuck in that, can't ya? Right, uh, what am I even- That doesn't even have anything on it. Some of these are just pointless. Alright, well that's connected. Or something. 
Can I connect this to anything? That is connected. Those are connected. Um. Those are connected, I guess. That one up there needs to change. That's better. That's better. Uh, they all seem connected now. Let's see if that works. That's- that's- that's all I can figure out for now. This doesn't seem to go anywhere. Gotcha. Are those messed up textures or stuff written on there? Looks like messed up textures. Not sure if it's my computer or the game that's got odd texture issues. But we seem to be going places, so that's at least good news. If I just keep walking, maybe eventually I'll get somewhere. Oh, and I have to rotate this... okay. I couldn't see these, apparently. So I need to rotate this... ...once, and that one... ...twice. Slow fall! Once. Twice. What the? Everything rotated all of a sudden. I guess because I got a solution, it, it forced the solution? That was weird. It saved the game, so apparently I did it right, but I saw other stuff rotate that I didn't click on. That was weird. Huh. Not sure what happened there. But at least I solved it, apparently, because I saw the save icon in the top right corner. Or, you know, the little saving load icon thing. You know what I mean, right? You guys- you guys have played video games before. You've- you've seen the save indicator in video games in the past, right? I'm not going crazy here. Oh, I bet you anything there's one of those red things hidden around here. I gotta check. I have to check. Oh, I can't even walk up there! Oh, come on, game. Well, I guess there's not one of those red things hidden up there, then. Right, slow walking speed. There's no... As far as I can tell, there's not a way to run any faster than I'm currently going. I can jump, but that's about it. There is no run speed at all. The Turing test was... The Turing test was interesting, because your, de your default speed... Actually, you had a run key and a walk key in the Turing test, and the walk key was only used for one optional puzzle. Alright, let's go up all the way to this top part now. Alright. That's a thing I've done. I have done that. Oh goodness. Oh my. I can walk on the outside rim of this? Really? Now that's fascinating. I wonder if I can actually get close enough... ...to jump onto this. Nope, invisible wall. Sadness. Right, well, now we gotta walk all the way back to the beginning and go through a different one. So this is... this is three underneath it. I don't know if that's significant to the number three that we're about to go to in a moment here, or not. Definitely looks like art. Has the guy commented on art at all? I don't think he's commented on the paintings. Mr. God Player Character Person has not commented on the paintings, to my knowledge. This is some very nice architecture, though. As I've said many times. I do love the visuals in this game, but the story... kind of... strange sense of humor... might not wesh mesh well with me. Wesh mesh... you know what I'm trying to say, I hope. So this is three. That's the one that had the moon. Supposedly. I haven't actually been in here yet, so let's find out. Isn't this a beautiful visual? Oh my goodness. Let's take a picture from the other side as well. It doesn't take a genius to see that I am a genius. Comparative statements are somewhat redundant when you're the lone wanderer of the universe. I think I'd like a goddess to share this with. We could walk around and talk about gold. Perhaps waste away the time discussing how brilliant I am. She could bask in my intellect and compliment me on my immense wealth. Perhaps she'd look like me too. Obviously she couldn't be as handsome, that would be unthinkable. Could I create a goddess more majestic than myself? Could I create a rock that I couldn't lift? 
Well, apparently I can create doors I cannot open. What does a goddess do, though? Quite clearly, I'm busy doing all this god stuff. Walking about, thinking about stuff, solving problems, inventing problems to solve. Would she be my helper, or off doing her own thing? I'm a pretty big deal. If I had a goddess, I'd assume she'd want to be around me most of the time. But I feel like I'm too busy with all these challenges to possibly give her all of my attention. I mean, to be fair, it's likely to destroy her given my godlike intensity. Maybe I'd make her in my image. That would be amazing! Two of me! Oh, we'd have so much in common! I'd quite like her to be lively. First, she'd have to be alive. Being alive is somewhat a prerequisite for being lively. I've not created life yet. I see as through a glass dimly, not knowing as I should know. 1113? What's that about? Can I use the sun at all? No, the sun does not count as a light source, but these other things do? What is even happening right now? I don't... I don't understand what I'm doing. Oh, really? Okay then? That's not at all what I expected this to work as. Oh, come on. Making me stand there now? Right. Stand here long enough for the gates to open, and then go through. More light. Slight obsession with light here. I'm done here. Is this... am I doing this right? What is even happening right now? Is this all I'm supposed to do? Because this seems a little bit... strange, if so. Holy crap, what is happening right now? That looks very trippy. Was that all I had to do, really? Well, okay then. That's also a very nice picture. <laughs> Everything in this game just looks beautiful. I honestly have no idea what's happening right now. The frame rate seems to be chugging a little bit, unfortunately. I tried my best to get the graphics to run okay, but can't always can't always have everything in life, I guess. It might just be a matter of the game being poorly optimized, I don't know. Yep, so we got one, two, and three done. Let's let's do four, I suppose. More of this nice architecture. Why can I be surprised? If I'm all-knowing, then I should know all. Perhaps there is a moment when knowledge is created. <sighs> Sometimes when I ask these questions, I wish there was a response. Wish there was someone out there listening to me, hearing these words. But how could they tell me even if they were listening? I've never heard their voice. If a voice came down from the sky to talk to me, I'd probably think I was crazy. Oh. <sighs> But, but in case anyone's listening, I have a surplus of gold. If you'd like to pop by my universe, I could give you some. Friendship for gold? Straight up trade? I'm trying to find one of these... There it is! One of the pieces of things laying on the ground. Alright, so I think that's enough exploration for this area. Yes, that's what I was trying to find. Hey, I can actually walk up here. Fancy that. Right, well, it's pretty clear what we have to do here. It's one of these. That did not move the one I expected it to. What moves this one? That? Okay, so entrance... That means that the exit's right there. Okay. I can work with that. Um... Want... That... There we go. Who knows what this one's for? Didn't need it. Yep, 
that seems to work out just fine in my book. What's with all these pots and crates? He, I know he mentioned the pots before, I don't remember him mentioning the crates. Maybe he did and I just forgot. Very slow walk speed. That's this done. I make a lot of mistakes and missteps. Do you? Can God make mistakes? A mistake is something unintended. Am I an imperfect God? Or perhaps, perhaps I'm not a God at all. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, let's not be silly. Of course I'm God. Hmm. Looks like it's based on rotation, so I have to walk backwards, it would seem. Oh, 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 almost. Yes, I do have to walk backwards, though. Sort of. Oops, yep. Oh my gosh, let me through, please. Oh my gosh, it's a little bit harder than it looks. Something about this is kind of weird. What is with the lighting? Why does it keep getting so dark? Stop getting so dark! That is so bright that it makes everything else dark. That is... That is a bad thing to do in a game. I hate lighting engines that work that way. Like, I know it's how the human eye works in real life, but it just drives me crazy when the light levels are constantly changing just because everything's not within proper brightness. It might be different on an HDR monitor, but I don't know that this game even supports HDR. Like, it's just simulating it. Right, well. This door must be open now. Yep, there it goes. It's opening now that we can see it. Still no companion. Forks in the path. Achievement unlocked. What if it's all a joke? This whole world? A grand joke of which I am the punchline. What if someone stands, looking on, grinning atop their high horse? An elevated perspective makes it easy to look down. What if someone distant and unknowable were forcing me to stumble around my world? Forcing me to overcome a series of mental obstacles, all for what? To demonstrate something? To teach something? What? So it seems like we have a few places, or ways to go here. Maybe I'm not a god. Maybe I'm a jester. Have you heard the one about the character who this? thought he was the infinite? His story came to an end. Quite the dramatic irony. Do I make my movements? My steps? I've never thought about a step I've Dude, made. Dude, what is this? It it's creeping me out! I'm thrown about this world. Do I control, or rather merely witness my movement? If it is the case that I'm merely oh witnessing my, my movement, my gosh! is this my body? Or am I an observer? Dude, this is freaky! Something about this makes me really, really... N scared, nervous, or something. This is freaking me out. Oh my goodness. I can't explain it, but this is like the scariest thing I've ever seen in a video game before. <laughs> oh man. Dude. Just look at it! Look at that! It's so cre- it's so freaky! I don't want to look at it. <laughs> this is- this says two, so maybe we should patience come back later. Patience is a virtue I possess. A god has infinite patience. A small proof of my deity. If I get frustrated with waiting, what does that mean? I'm not a god? Hmm. Suppress. Just a momentary lapse of reason. Existential crisis. Everyone has one. Don't worry about it. Suppress! What the? <laughs> For some reason, the the game rotates it in such a way that it resets as I'm standing on it. This is interesting, to say the least. That's what happens when you code code movement based on where the player is looking. Anyway, what is this even supposed to do? Am I supposed to point it at something and make it stop, or? Is 
It said two, right? Maybe we need to make it on- make it stop on two? Did that do anything? Doesn't quite seem like it. And it resets every time, huh. Yeah. I wonder why, though. Let's just sit and watch it rotate and see if maybe it- Maybe we just need to watch it and be patient. Really? I just had to- I just had to watch it? Okay then. Sure. Sure. Oh no, the ghost! Let's just not think about it too much. Apparently I was supposed to do this first. Doesn't matter. Light has curious properties. It drives out darkness, or perhaps it's the other way around. Perhaps light is the absence of darkness. I should find out. How much light do you need to fill a bucket? Four? Am I supposed to make a certain pattern? Am I supposed to make that pattern? How though? Left click doesn't do anything. They seem to just activate when you get near. Do I need to jump? Oh! Apparently jumping was the solution! Yes. Jumping makes it so that I'm only close enough to the center one. Okay then. That's- that's solved, I suppose. What's in these other areas? Ghost. Don't think about the ghost. Don't think about the ghost. Just pretend it's not there. Don't think about the ghost. Right, what's down here? Is this just where you have to come up from if you fall? I need to find one of those red things. That's laying on the ground somewhere. So we'll be- we'll keep an eye out. Ha 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 ha. Don't think about the ghost- oh my gosh, it's so scary! I'm- I'm- I'm literally serious that this is creepy. There's something about this is just very unsettling for me. It- it creeps me out, okay? Uh, I don't see any of the red things, so I guess this is just where you end up if you fall. Yes. Right, so. Don't need to do anything there, I, I guess. But let us walk slowly back up these stairs. Alright. Don't think about the ghost. Don't think about the ghost. Don't think about the ghost. Nothing here. Okay. Don't think about the ghost. Don't think about the ghost. Okay. Anything here? Not particularly. Just checking. Just checking for collectibles, you know. Uh, I'm not gonna check in there, though. Don't think about it, just pretend I'm walking on solid floor! Okay. I think we're finally past that now. Perhaps my lack of control is rational. I have two observable natures as far as I can see, my body and my mind. My body moves around doing things. It can be pushed away by equal and opposite forces. It is constrained by the world. My mind creates thoughts that it speaks. I thought you wanted to have a body because you didn't have one yet. Now all of a sudden you're talking as though you do have one? When did you make one? I wasn't paying attention. I swear, they're gonna hide one of these things where I have to look at it over the edge here. Maybe not. This. Now this. It's a screenshot. 
Just look at that. I don't even know which one I'm gonna pick, but they're so nice looking. Everything looks so nice in this game. Uh, oh, seams in the world. Seems like there's seams. Where exactly might you be hiding one of these collectibles? Evidently not here. Yes, well, let's press the button. Oh my gosh! <laughs> what? Okay then, let's see what's in here first, before we go anywhere crazy. I guess we need three... I guess we need to solve three before that'll do anything? Okay then. Frame rate's much better if I look up. Look at that, the frame rate is beautiful! Stellar frame rate. And then I look at everything else and oh my gosh, the frame rate chugs. Frame... beautiful frame rate, chugging frame rate. <laughs> I'm so sorry. What is my nature though? Unitary, bipartite, or tripartite, or something other? How could I know? I have my words. Words are the product of a mind. Therefore it follows that I think. I think, therefore I am. Cogito ergo zoom. I move, so I have a body. Maybe a spirit too. Something intangible. A connection with a world I cannot know. Alright, so. That's a corner. That's a corner. So. These two need to be black. That much I know. I guess we can rotate it. The opposite corner. I don't know if we flip it or rotate it, though. That's the thing. Let's go with... let's go with my assumption of flipping first. Alright, there's that. Then... That looks about the same to me. Right, so, flipping it is incorrect. Gotcha. Let's undo these ones that I did. So that we can rotate it instead. Right. So, this is the corner, and we need to rotate it. There's that. go. And then... these. That looks right to me. What did I do wrong, though? Do I need to do this one at the same time? Maybe. How do I know that I've got it- got them right, though? Alright, so that's the corner. Oh, this one doesn't even have to be rotated. This one's already done for me. Oh, this one's got rounded corners, and this one... Oh, this one's got... Okay, so this one goes to here, and that one goes to here. I see now. Right, gotta undo this. I think after this we'll stop the episode. I don't know how much of the game I have left, honestly, but who knows. Alright, so. Hmm. It 
so from the corner, it's those two. I think it's like this, right? Uh, looks right to me. Alright, so this one... ...from the corner... ...we need the top right, and then some of these ones in the middle, blah blah blah. Oh! Apparently I did it right, cause that suddenly solved everything. Yes, right. Well guys, as always... Thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!